These skirts are what the girls in Radia, what caused the problem in Radia and the reason that the ministry ended up supporting them. I'm showing you the original skirt. And they are the same size. And it's straight. Yes. But this is what are you going to drink? The girls were using. All right? Are you happy? <laughs> then the school, the school without consulting the girls, even without consulting the teachers, went and changed the skirt. The, long one. the school went and developed this. This is the same size as that. It's for the same girl. They went and changed the skirt. And you will notice that, although I'm not a girl, if you are wearing this and you are for one girl, it will be right down at the, the top. So that is what the school did. And this is what now caused the girls to start saying you are not dressing us well. The, the, the girls themselves <laughs> clandestinely started adjusting they started now going to their homes or in their rooms and adjusting that skirt to this. Alright? You can compare this to the other. You are welcome. They would then adjust this for themselves, being young girls and feeling that they were not smart enough in that, they changed to this. It's shorter by about three inches. Now, the trouble is that the moment a girl was caught having adjusted this cut, she was being forced to buy five cuts. Did you get what I said? The school imposed a punishment system whereby the girl was required to wear this and she would go home or to her room and adjust. If she is caught, she is ordered to buy five of these cuts. And that is what led to the dispute. Now, once the ministry intervened and we brought both the school and the pupils together under Article 10, in inclusiveness, public consultation, they settled for this, which is now acceptable both to the girls, to the school administration, and to the parents, and to the student councils.